Understanding Soil Stabilization in Road Construction Welcome to Blueprint to Reality, your go-to source for all things civil and structural engineering. In today's video, we'll be discussing soil stabilization and its crucial role in road construction. From enhancing soil strength to improving durability, soil stabilization is a key process for building long-lasting roads, especially in challenging terrain. Let's dive in. 1. What is soil stabilization? Soil stabilization is the process of improving the properties of soil to increase its strength, stability, and resistance to weathering. This is achieved by adding certain materials or chemicals to the soil, allowing it to support the weight of roads, reduce water absorption, and prevent erosion. Soil stabilization is especially important for roads constructed in areas with weak or unstable soil, such as clay, sandy, or expansive soils. 2. Why is soil stabilization important in road construction? In road construction, the quality of the subgrade, the soil layer that supports the road structure, is crucial for the stability and longevity of the pavement. Without proper stabilization, the subgrade may experience shifting, cracking, or erosion, which leads to road failure. By stabilizing the soil, engineers can create a solid foundation that can withstand traffic loads, moisture changes, and extreme weather conditions. Three types of soil stabilization methods. There are two primary types of soil stabilization, mechanical and chemical. Mechanical stabilization, this involves physically altering the soil by mixing it with aggregates, such as gravel or sand, to improve its texture and strength. This method helps to create a more uniform soil structure that resists deformation under pressure. Chemical stabilization, this method uses chemical agents, such as lime, cement, or fly ash, to react with the soil and form a stronger, more durable bond. These chemicals improve the soil's load-bearing capacity, reduce plasticity, and enhance moisture resistance. Chemical stabilization is particularly effective for clay soils that tend to shrink or swell with moisture changes. For common stabilizing agents and their benefits. Lime. Lime stabilization is one of the most commonly used methods, particularly for clay soils. It reacts with the soil to reduce its plasticity and improve its compaction properties. Lime stabilization also helps control the soil's moisture content and increases its strength. Cement. Cement stabilization involves mixing cement with soil to create a more rigid, load-bearing foundation. This method is ideal for areas with poor, weak soils and is commonly used in urban road construction. Fly ash. Fly ash, a byproduct of burning coal in power plants, is a sustainable stabilizing agent that improves soil's strength and durability. It is often used in combination with lime or cement to enhance soil stabilization. Polymer additives. In some cases, polymer additives are used for stabilization, especially in areas requiring enhanced moisture resistance and flexibility. These additives can provide a high level of durability while being more environmentally friendly than traditional chemicals. 5. Benefits of Soil Stabilization in Road Construction Soil stabilization offers several key advantages. Improved load-bearing capacity, Stabilized soil provides a stronger foundation, enabling roads to handle heavier traffic loads without deterioration. Enhanced durability. Stabilized soil is more resistant to erosion, cracking, and shifting, extending the lifespan of the road. Cost effectiveness. Stabilizing local soils reduces the need for costly imported materials, leading to savings in construction costs. Better drainage and moisture resistance. Properly stabilized soil helps reduce water infiltration, which can lead to pavement cracking and erosion. This is particularly beneficial in regions with heavy rainfall or fluctuating temperatures. 6. Challenges in Soil Stabilization While soil stabilization is highly beneficial, it does come with some challenges. The cost of certain stabilizing agents, such as cement or lime, can be high, particularly in large-scale projects. Additionally, the success of soil stabilization depends on factors like soil type, moisture content, and climate conditions. In some cases, soil testing is required to determine the most effective stabilization method, which can increase project timelines. 7. Environmental Considerations 
The environmental impact of soil stabilization is an important consideration, especially when using chemical agents like lime or cement. Overuse of certain chemicals can lead to soil imbalances and pollution. However, advancements in eco-friendly stabilizing agents, such as bio-based polymers and recycled materials, are helping to make soil stabilization more sustainable and environmentally friendly. 8. The Future of Soil Stabilization With ongoing research and technological advancements, the future of soil stabilization looks promising. New, sustainable stabilizing agents and more efficient methods of application are making soil stabilization more cost-effective and eco-friendly. Additionally, smart technologies such as soil moisture sensors and automated mixing equipment are improving the precision and efficiency of stabilization processes. These innovations will allow engineers to better design and construct roads that are both durable and environmentally responsible. Soil stabilization is a cornerstone of road construction, ensuring that roads are built on a solid, durable foundation. As technology continues to evolve, the methods used to stabilize soil will only improve, offering more sustainable solutions for the roads of the future. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to blueprint to reality we'll be back with more insights into civil engineering thanks for watching